Alright guys, I have a big bass on. I have a little kitchen, I was going for a little sunfish. Yo, when I go, we're just bashing on top water, guys. Oh my god. What kind of rod are you using? This is a little micro rod. I'm setting the dread real low. I've got like two pound of rain on here. I'm gonna wear him out a little bit. Yeah, because that line's kind of frayed too. Where'd he go? Still on it's a big bass. Look at the line bend. It's, it's hilarious. I want to see this thing. There it is. Oh, oh, is. oh that's been nice. Oh my god, yeah. Oh, I He's gonna jump, he's gonna jump. Here we go. Let me get it. Little get it. Right, oh man, it's gonna be in a week. Walk in there, you already walk in there. Right here. He's right here. Oh, I see. He's a nice bass. He's a nice bass. Can I go in there? Stay there, baby. Stay there, baby. Come here, come here. Come here. Come on, that is a nice one, buddy. Color on that guy. Mm. He does not like you. I'm trying to get him stuck in here so I can. Show us what you got. Show us what oh. you got. Show us what you got. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah. Got a little micro rod. I caught you. That is awesome. We saw this pass and I was doing it and I got it caught in the weed bag up there. And I was like trying to like do something and this bass jumped up and got this thing. And it's a nice bass. I'm freaking out because I was expecting Yeah, it's this, a big bass. This this is like puppy caught. Two pound line. Not even. On this little micro rod. And this is a How big you think that is? Oh, two and a half. Two and a half? Look at the stomach on him. It's like a two and a half pound bass. Oh the size, you see the girth on it? Huh? Oh yeah, we'll get the girth on them. We'll try and try and measure them up a little bit, and we'll go them on we size. Have the we should have brought a scale or something. Scale, but dude, this is the nice bass. I was reeling it in over there, and I took this little thing, and I got it caught on weeds, and I kind of like lifted it, and it was like on top of the water. And then this bass, he just hits it, and this is a tiny little micro spin rod, and I just put a little gets it on there. I'm not going for these fish. Here's the mouth on him. He gave up a pretty good fight. <laughs> Here he is on the side. We'll take a measurement on him and we'll take a girth on him. Kind of measure it up with our fingers and then we'll put him on size.com and I'll get a size for you guys. But uh, let me just give him some air. We're going to get a few pictures and we'll get back to you guys. Guys, here's the fish. One last view of him. Nice bass. Two and a half, three pounds. You can just see the stomach. Uh, first, we're going to get the girth on this guy and uh, we'll get back to you on the release. Alright guys, we're letting this fish go. Nice fight. You guys got the whole fight too of everything. See, we're reviving them a little bit. You can see the size of this fish here. Alright, I think he's ready. Let's get a video of him, let him go. There he is. He gave up a beautiful fight. He's a nice fish. You can see him swimming. He's gonna swim out, this drops off over there. He's gonna swim out. You can still see him. This water is beautiful. We're at a deep quarry lake. And he just gave us a good fight. All right, I'll get back to you guys with some more bass fishing, hopefully. Hey, YouTube, what's up? The Am Outdoorsman here. Today I just caught this nice bass. We just came to this pond. It's a brand new pond. We just started fishing it. And I got my Powell Max, uh, I believe it's in 7 foot, 
It's the spinnerbait rod paired with the Shimano Corrado. 12 pound line. I'm using a Max Tackle Ghost Minnow spinnerbait and 3 8 ounce. I'm telling you, I've caught three bass on this this year. It's the only spinnerbait that's worked. Here it is, right here. He's a nice, I'd say half pound. Oh, and he has a hook in his mouth, actually. Look at that. He swallowed that one. Whatever it is, it's down deep inside him. You can actually see the hook in his mouth. So someone's caught him and he's come off. So I'll get back to you guys with more bass. I caught him right at the uh, right when I was reeling it in right over here. He came. I don't know where he came from, but he just came out of nowhere and hooked him. I got him right there. You can see the place. So he wasn't going anywhere. But I'll get back to you guys, dude. He has. We're gonna release him right here in this pond. Let him go back to where he came from. Let him revive a little bit. See when he's ready. There he goes. Alright, let's go catch some more. 